due to some sudden emergency, Prakka had to fly to India yesterday at the last minute, and unfortunately, he won't be able to be here with us for the filming. So me, Sarva, and Dean will be covering the whole presentation. Thank you. So I'll start the presentation. Hello everyone, my name is Jachivan and I will be starting the presentation of Aeromobile Aero Ambulance Innovation for the hospitals. We have four group members, Dean, Jachivan, Masal, Mohammed Sarva, Prakha Goja. So the first slide. It's a table of contents. It's, it has several contents. First one is vision, second one is value proposition, third one is advantages over competition, key partners, additional requirements of resources, use of channels, target market, structure of cost, stream of revenue, sneak peek in the future, and conclusion. The first one, vision. The vision of Aeromobile is to deliver the automatic exceptional service to the citizens for the of the society, serving for their needs, especially in the case of emergency in a quicker than ever manner before. The set, this sets the bar higher for the service to the people. Value proposition. Aeromobile 3.0 Aero Ambulance will be a driverless model and will be designed specially for the hospitals. It has an it will be having an automatic warning system which will generate signals to the control room if it requires any refilling of equipment or something else. It will also have a self-emergency detector system which will fly out to the locations following the phone's GPS system if they have any report of an emergency or any case. The aeromobile ambulance will send an automatic signal update to the control room regarding its location and landing and returning back. Traveling at a speed of 200 plus kilometer it will be used to tackle traffic situations and long road traffic. So, advantages over competition. It will it has several advantages over competition. As all you know, Aeromobile do not have any competition right now in the market. It is the only one in the Indian market who's making these flying and running cars. So, Aeromobile ambulance can give an edge to the air ambulances. Helicopters take a lot of time to take off and to land, whereas aeromobile ambulance is much quicker in this case. It requires only 20 stripes to take off and 20 stripes to land. The control of helicopter is much harder as compared to the aeromobile ambulance. As aeromobile is a driverless car, it doesn't require any special flying license or something. So helicopters also require to control flights, whereas aeromobile doesn't need anyone. It is a Travelers approach. Key partners. Key partners of Aero Ambulance can be NHS, private hospitals. So, in my opinion, these two are the main key partners, as they can, as they are the only reason for the innovation of Aero Ambulance. And the SP Services. SP Services is the site which provides medical stuff for the medical purposes. So, SP Services is a company that can provide additional kits to the aeromobile and several other additional values, materials for the ambulances, which can be a major partner of aero ambulance. So from here on out, my partner, Mohammed Sarva, will carry on. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Jagdeva. My name is Mohammed Sarva, and I'm going to talk about the next one is additional requirement resources. With the coming use of this, and the hospital need to hire uh, extra staff which traveling in an aero ambulance. An aero ambulance will be teaming with uh, with the SP service for the portable medical kits. And a control room will be required for the controlling of these aero ambulances ambulances as there will be travelers and will require a central control room, control system. The cost of one aero ambulance is approximately eight lakh pounds, which adds up more cost of equipment and control room. The use of channels. The use of channel reach out with the help of ruling government. Introduce, introduce a new idea to the people via social media websites. Add videos on YouTube, 
uh, to show the customer it's needed. Old exhibitions with the motto of Aero Ambulance, giving a real life experience to the people. Price of Aero Ambulance will be cheaper for the civil services, civil service than for the normal consumer. Target market. The main target market, the main target market is ambulance service. Once aero ambulance becoming a success among amongst the hospital, the next aim will be to the target police, military service and fire defense. The main aim will be to cover the most of NHS and private hospital in a three year time. Structure of cost. The little bit I'm gonna show about the structure of cost. The structure of cost uh, and uh, is a center for the manufacturer you can see the manufacturing cost is uh, 2 lakh pound and the SP service equipment 30,000 pound. The cost of labor will be is, um, 1 lakh and 80,000 pound. Marketing cost is 1 lakh and 50,000 pound. The last one is technical support. You know, an aero ambulance is driverless, so it's it's mostly used in technical schools, so it costs one leg pounds. So, uh, aero ambulance uh, manufacturing one aero ambulance cost around two leg pound. Will be include the equipment from would equipment from our partner SP service worth thirty thousand pounds with each aero mobile. The cost of labor are service and engineer and of the engineers building the model. Marketing cost involves covering the uh, documentary documentaries and exhibition. Exhibition and uh, technical sports is to deal with any force uh, or issues in this manufactured products. <coughs> but the total cost is six leg and sixty thousand pounds, which is uh, going to uh, incur uh, in the process of uh, developing the aero ambulance. The next part is my my colleague going to describe. So please, David, come here and so continue. Please. Thank you for the more hours. The next slide is a uh, I keep talking about the uh, stream and uh, revenue. Uh, firstly, uh, the revenue margin when providing aero ambulance uh, uh, will be much cheaper than the normal aeromobile 3.0 for the normal consumers. Uh, the next, the profit margin on one finished uh, product uh, will just be around. What uh, 140,000 pounds? As nice as uh, aero ambulance is a product of uh, aero build, which means it has no real competitors of its own standard. Uh, uh, there will be monopoly of our services uh, to hospitals and uh, will save more lives. As the last one, expected sales will be approached. Um, uh, approximately um, uh, 14.4 million pounds in the first three years, considering the sale of six aero ambulance per year. The next slide is a sneak peek into the future uh, introduction of artificially intelligent aero, aero police and aero fire defense. And the second one. Aero police will also have cameras which will play the role of CCTV 
sending leaf stream to the patrolling police as the last one arrow fire defense uh, will have automatic uh, smoke sensors which will spray water and uh, the last one I will talk about the conclusion uh, first uh, firstly arrow ambulance will will prove to benefit the uh, people of the society and let's uh, have to uh, our ambulance uh, helps the people will be available much easier than ever before. Um, the more, uh, moreover, this will uh, include the ethical goodwill of the company Aeromobile as they will sell their products at a cheaper price to serve the civil defense system. Uh, the total cost of building an aero ambulance will be six. Uh, 160,000 pounds and will earn uh, 800,000 per piece sold. Uh, Aeromobile uh, profit margin as a whole will increase and uh, will wrap more consumer attention. Uh, with the help of the new partners, Aero Ambulance will have medical kits and other equipment provided. Uh, and the last one, in the future, uh, the future holds the introduction of Aero Police and Aero Fire Defense. Thank you for your listening. So thank you everyone for attending our presentation. And I'm very sorry about the colleague, my Prasbakha who is not here for the video. And hope he will be fine too. Thank you everyone.